ki khubor ka batisi tv lawan ra shapi da ka orange nissan loom so pho near fire brigade shillong admissions are open at bdw international school enroll now ka jingyalang jong ka kinhon mentri sarkar ka balalong menta ka sngi ka arpu pratrik ubnai kala linkot arjar arpu ar kala pun khre ban pha shaka sarkar india ya ka jingterwa jong ka halor ka jingpen bet thamma ya ka six schedule katkum ge jingpen bet thamma jong ka sarkar meghalaya ka bala shim katkum ge jing ai jingmut jong ki district council la ong bala pen bet ba ka khasi hills autonomous district council bat ha garo hills autonomous district council ka jingdon jong ki mdc kam dai ban tam ye ka sao phongut bat ki mdc shu se kim dai ban tam ye ka sao ngut kat ba jaintia hills autonomous district council pan la ong ba ka jingdon jong ki mdc kam dai ban tam ye ka lai phu ar ngut bat ki mdc ba shu se kim dai ban tam ye ka ar ngut na lor ka ni ka mat ka jingelang jong ka kinhon mentri sarkar kala rai ban pha ro ka jingterwa sha ka sarkar india ba dai ban thau ye ki village councils bat ye ki chairman jong ki village councils ha ban shu je de ka election bat ki bala ban long chairman kin dai tang ki sardar ki rang ba shnong ne ki nokma bat ye uskratri jong ka council ru ha ban shu je de ka election lait ne ki ni ki art li ki mat ka sarkar kala shimba baro ki jingterwa ban pen bet thamma ye ki kindon jong ka six shadow kila bit la biang lun as you are aware that uh, uh, most of the areas have been uh, sorted out and the issues have been resolved the last uh, few pending issues were regarding the number of seats uh, in the councils and regarding the formation uh, of the village councils uh, in the number of seats uh, the proposal that the government of meghalaya has given is that uh, khasi hills and garo hills shall have not more than 440 uh, members uh, out of which not more than 4 will be nominated and the rest will be elected through adult suffrage and for jente hills uh, jente hills will have uh, not more than 32 members out of which not more than 2 will be nominated and the rest will be elected through uh, adult suffrage uh, then in terms of the village council the uh, the members uh, the cabinet has uh, proposed that uh, we should uh, that the village councils uh, will be elected uh, but the uh, chairman uh will be an ex officio will be the uh rangbashong the sordar or the nokma will be the de facto chairman of the village council and the secretary will be elected and uh, as per the different uh, provisions the other members also will be elected but the chairman of uh, every village council will by de facto be the rangbashong or the sordar or the uh, nokma as per the or the head slash headman So these are the two recommendations, which were the last uh, few pending issues that were left. Uh, we have proposed it, and this has been done, of course, after thorough consultation and a discussion with all different uh, stakeholders, uh, including the district councils themselves. And these suggestions have come from the district councils, and accordingly, the state government has proposed this to the government of India. And these proposals will go in the next few days. And I will also be discussing this once I go to Delhi for discussion on the border issue. If you can go through the language that I have proposed, uh, I have mentioned to you, it says shall not have more than 40. So if you have 36, 35, 32, that's up to uh, Garo Hills and Kasi Hills. Uh, how many uh, that will be there? Of course, there will be a process for doing that. But point is that it will not be more than 40. Absolutely, those are uh, those uh, we have already discussed with uh, the uh, government of India and MHA also, and that particular clause uh, will not be there. So in the JGDC, uh, um, we have got to receive the letter from uh, the uh, chairman as well as from different members uh, regarding the uh, resignation of nine EMs, and at the same time, uh, we'd also got a, a note for a, uh, asking for a special session and a no confidence motion against the CEM. And uh, based on those uh, letters that have uh, come in, uh, the uh, matter was referred to the governor. and governor based on his power under para 365 has uh, gone ahead and uh, asked for uh, the 
special session to be called where the, um, where the no confidence motion will be held and the CEM will have to prove his majority. So, as I said, uh, there are multiple aspects to it and um, so therefore uh, it could be anything. But as I said now, let the democratic process follow and uh, really we have always maintained that we uh, try to stay uh, away from the interference of any kind uh, in the district councils and uh, we still maintain that even now.